Mm-hmm. What else could we get? Apparently something down here. Oh, that thing that fell. Oh, that was what the craven was holding, wasn't it? Okay, let's go here. Okay, up, left, up. Up. Left. Up. Right, up, down. We did it! You're gonna be a kitty cat for Halloween? Awesome! We got lightning achievement as well. Okay, so snake was here. And then butterfly was there. And then giraffe and turtle. We now have a fragment! I'm not sure what we need that for, but we have it! Wow, there's cravens everywhere, and they're all animated. It's awesome. Let's have a look at our map here. Wait, where is it? Ah, right here. Ah, you see, the map is telling us we've missed a collection item. Man, I could use some Chinese food right now, so I could totally use... ...some chopsticks, too. Okay, so we're missing a collection item here. Might be over here somewhere, I don't know. Gotta get rid of those... ...somehow? Hey Susan! I'm here! On the captain's bridge! Come on up! Hey there! Apparently he knows us. That is a Pangonian island. And that is Captain Finuer Stullburn. Uh-oh. What's happened? Mr. Pegleg. A few years ago, we came home in this ship from a journey and agreed to meet in half a year. When the time came, everyone was here but Captain Stalburn. After a few days of waiting, one of the sailors noticed something when he viewed Pangonian Island through his looking glass. It was one of those energy capsules with the body of our captain inside. We've tried to get there with our ship, but every time we've gotten lost in the magic mist. You should start at his house if you want to get to the truth behind all this. There's a hidden passage to the house in the cellar, but you'd need a key. Okay. Morphing object first. Gather all the collectibles. Hmm. The Grey Flounder, the trading ship belonging to Captain Stillburn. After the captain's disappearance, the crew stayed for a little while on the ship, moored at the Bay of Sorrows. But after a wave of repression by the Earl of the Province, all the crew members disappeared. One was locked in a dungeon. Another hides in the cellars around town, and the others left to move inland. The Grey Flander still lies on the shore today. But sailors say that on days of strong storm, they can see a mysterious ghost ship resembling the Grey Flander, with just one crew member guarded by a giant octopus. Anytime someone dares to come near the strange ghost ship, it disappears instantly, and the storm ends. Aha! Looks like we're going to have to get ourselves a gear. Look at this. Like the, It just looks amazing. The art here is fantastic. Like, look at how the rope has got, like, little frays all over it. And there's, like, this, a misty just, sort of dust going on here. Mr. Seagull's up there. Looks incredible. Okay. Click on the crystals to direct the green light over all of the lines. Holy cow. How does this work? Oh boy. Um. You are going to be successful. 
I hope. Please work. Yay! Yes, ghoulish knight. Or ghoulish ninja, yes. This game is made by 5BN, who made Darkness and Flame, and the New York Mysteries, yes. Absolutely. One of my all-time favorite developers. We now have a key, and we have a hand. Is this key gonna go here? Captain's no. cabin is behind this door. He probably took the key with him. Aha. The key. I'm gonna go ahead and take that crystal. Oh no, there's the captain. I have played uh, a couple of the Grim Facade games, yes. Honestly, I think the, like I've played 300 Hidden Object games, 350. So if you just go to the YouTube channel and search a game, you'll have a sense of, uh, you know, you'll know right away if I've recorded it or not. Okay, let's look, uh, actually I want to look at our map, see if we're... Okay, we're, we're doing okay with collectibles. We're doing alright. Available actions. Let's go here. The key is going to open up here. Uh, we made a secret ladder or something. Oh, looks like someone already had a look around. Mm-hmm. An axe. And a ship. Which we need, because it's a collectible. Of course it is. Don't forget, folks, we are looking for morphing objects. Oh, hello there. To Captain Stillburn, your wife, Natal? I can't, how do you say that name? Night, that's a neat name, but I don't even know how to say it. Nightel? Nightiel? Anyways, your wife is mine now. I have taken a great liking to her, and you must step aside. Do not attempt to get her back. If you dare to enter my castle, you won't leave alive. Wow, this Earl is a super duper jerk. I think Captain went to the Earl's castle to get his wife. I hope you're not going after him. Oh no, are you sure? Well, all right, it's up to you. In the meantime, I'll search for the rest of the crew. Be careful. And stick to the shadows, please. Here, take this drawing. I got it from my granddad, a berserker warrior. It could prove useful. We now have a mm, recipe, it looks like. Berserker poison instant sleeping potion. One vessel of wolf blood. One sleeping flower root sap. We need a weapon, a needle from a hedgehog tree, a skylark feather, a goblin hair, and bamboo tube. Uh, yes, Grim Facade Red Cat is indeed out right now. Uh, Skyrim Remastered. Do you get that for free if you own the original Skyrim? Because I do own the original Skyrim. We have a ladder. Put that up there. There's got to be a morphing object around here, folks. Oh, we have another note. Captain Stillburn, adventurer and captain of the trading ship, the Grey Flounder. In the Lost Lands, he gained fame after being involved in a series of strange events. One fine day, the resident of Misko spotted a magical structure on a nearby Pangonian island. They called it the Energy Reservoir. In this very reservoir, Captain Stillburn's body was found. Till this day, nobody knows the nature of the place and how the body could have turned up there. They say that the plane lies with the new Earl who kidnapped Stillborn's wife. Legend has it that since the time the captain's spirit has been traveling between the worlds in the ship accompanied by a giant octopus. Crazy old mom, you're following on beam. Wow, good to see you over there. I think you're my very first follower on a beam. There's something in the pillow. 
So the PC version of Remastered Skyrim is free for those who own it. Okay, then I own it. But I, I can't you just mod Skyrim and make it look pretty anyways? Oh, look, there's the morphing object. So in case you're curious, crazy old mom, yes, I can see the Beam chat as well. Yeah, I just checked out Beam a few days ago and uh, I kind of like it. It's kind of neat. So I am streaming to Beam. And I'm also being able to see the chat on Beam as well. So there you go. Thank you for stopping by there and checking that out. Uh, Alright. So, we have a note here and it's a recipe. So, um... Do I actually have any of this stuff? I don't think I do. I need wolf blood. Wolf blood. Let's put the clock in back here. The clock won't show the time correctly without both hands. That's my understanding as well, crazy mold mom, that the chat delay is really short over there on beam as well. I know, Arabeth, I know. Hitbox, Twitch, YouTube, and beam. It's beam.pro, P-R-O, slash your gibbs. Four of them. Do you know where I also want to stream at some point once I f figure out the tech? Is streaming on Facebook. That is my... Eventually I'll be doing that as well. <laughs> once I figure out the tech. Uh, okay, so we've got ourselves an axe. Let's go up here and see what's cooking. It's dark. Something's behind the spider web. I need to remove it. I don't see no spider web, do you? Hmm. All right. There was a hurt wolf. Yes, that's right. Hmm. So I guess we should, but I don't have really anything that I could think that the wolf might want, or even this rat over here too. You think the lock pick looks like a baby crowbar? Sure, sure, why not? Like we have to go back into the cabin or the captain's house. Oh, we have a gear and a candle. Some heraldy seems to be missing here. Uh, Raven's Eye, what is a good idea? Are you talking about streaming on Facebook? Uh, I don't know. Oh, we can go back and light it over here. Let's do this. Light it up, up, up. Who wants meat? Oh, for a second there I thought you meant the wolf wants wolf meat. That can't be good. Let's see here. Let's go up there and peek up here and then... Aha! It's a beaver! Oh, oh I'm okay. Well, now I have to replace all the broken steps with new ones to find out what's inside that hatch. Oh no, we broke the ladder. Streaming at many places at once actually does not put a strain on my computer at all because I use a special tech that allows me to do that. I must remain all... Oh, I must replace all the broken steps. Okay, so we have a beaver tail, so let's go there. Where was Mr. Beaver Tail? Back here, I believe. Uh, back further? Aha! Right to where we started from. Is that a foot or a tail? <laughs> oh, it is a tail. All right. Still have to do something in here eventually as well. Hmm. Nothing I can see here. Let's go forward. Beaver tail makes me think of that tasty waffly treat. Have you guys ever eaten beaver tail? I don't mean like the actual animal beaver tail. I mean like that waffly uh, pastry delight. That kind of beaver tail. I can't use a lock pick to open this lock. That makes no sense, game. What about an axe? No. No. 